Now the next thing is we have to implement the login register button. So after the password we can say login sign up button. Register simply means sign up. It will be double dot infinity child elevated button on pressed apply some style on it background color will be the default colors dot primary color after the style and say child padding padding const agent set dot symmetric vertically it will be at after the padding we will basically display our uh, button names login register now it will be on the base of toggle okay also uh, one more thing is uh, we have to let's say when we connect of course we will connect our project with firebase when the user click in case when the user click on the register or login button then in that case we will display a loading bar or you can say a progress bar so when the user is registered or logged in successfully then we will disappear the progress or you can say the loading bar what it means is uh, when the user click then the name of the button will be disappear that is login or register will disappear and a circular progress bar will appear now how let's implement it then you will understand it easily I'm going to create a variable by the name loading on the default value for this will be false that is loading on is off okay when it has a false value it simply means it is not loading however when it is true it simply means it is loading on so what we can do after the padding we can say loading on so if it is loading on that is if it has a true value it simply means we have to display the circular progress bar so you can say size box and this size box first let me complete the condition else if it is loading that is if it has a true value we will display the circular progress indicator which we will implement inside this size box otherwise if it is false if it is not loading then simply display the name of that button So for the progress we can set its height, height will be 19, width will be 19 and the at the center of that button, elevated button we are going to display the it is by the name circular progress indicator and you can set the color for it so the color we want for it is white just like this as you can see and make sure to add a const modifier with this size box as it has constant values and just a circular progress indicator otherwise if it is not loading then we have to display the button name now that button names also depend on a condition which is does user wants to sign up so if the user wants to sign up then in that case the button name will be sign up otherwise if the user does not want to sign up then in that case the button name will be login other than this let's apply some style
only font size we will apply and that will be 18 So this is all about our login sign up button. Now we have to also add the toggle button. First let's check out, let's test our application how it looks. So you see it looks like this. This will be the sign up and the other one of course make sure that to give it a default value false because we want to start from the login form. Okay. Otherwise, if you want that the sign up form you want to see at the start, then you have to leave this default value to true. And other than that, now we will add our toggle button basically here on which the user will tap. So we will uh, switch between the login form and the sign up form. Let's add some space after the password text field so that it looks good. Also, let's add some space after the elevate outline button. And here, uh, 9 will be enough. Now, let's see how it looks. You see, it looks good now. And the condition, let me also show it to you that is loading on. So as I told you guys when the user tap only then we will see that uh, loading progress bar okay because we will be communicating with the server with the firebase in order to log in or sign up. So for example when it stands true only then we will see that of course we will set the values of it once we implement the backend for it okay. So just for now for the testing purposes change the value to true and then when you hot restart you will see that okay it will look like this beautiful okay make sure to change this back to false like this